gonna be yeah whatever <coughs> yeah hi guys uh yes we're entering mad monster mansion this has happens to be my favorite level of the whole game it's uh spooky like kind of halloweenish thingy i guess i like halloween because uh as most of you know or as all of you who actually take your time to read my profile, you know that I'm from Puerto Rico. And temperatures here are like tropical. And around summer, it's 80 to 90 degrees, sometimes 100, depending on how hot <coughs> the summer is going to be. And on Christmas, <coughs> around October, it goes down to 70 to 60 degrees so every time I think about Halloween it's kind of like my favorite time of the year because the temperatures go down this heat wave goes away uh, you can say that I really hate the heat and basically uh, I really don't like much this summer you can barely sleep because the it's so hot that you gotta open like all of the windows doesn't matter if you turn off turn on the fan it's just it's just gonna like blow steam at you and it's pretty bad but you know <clears throat> but I guess enough about that uh, yeah that's why I like this level because it just reminds me of Halloween <laughs> so here the jigsaws are slightly better hidden as of course they keep getting uh, better hidden as we go on. Uh, I'm not sure if uh, as you go on the levels get longer. I really doubt it. So far I've always taken three videos to finish up a level. And I think I will be able to do so with this one. On the practice run, I did get lost on this level because I really had forgotten a lot of stuff. Uh, and as I play, well, I started to remember some stuff. <clears throat> and I was glad that I did a practice run because I really wasn't going to be able to uh, deliver this quickly. I guess for now, I guess I can do it as fast as I can, though this is not a speed run, it's just that I really like my let's plays to go fast and sweet, and just cover as much material as possible and go as fast as I can so that it doesn't take that many videos. Uh, depending on something that is going to happen <coughs> soon, I'm going to be updating a video making an update video so watch out for that too and I suggest that all of you watch it I know that not everyone it's gonna be interested in update videos <clears throat> but they are important because you know that if for example I make a an update video that it's about me saying that I'm gonna go for a couple of weeks or something like that then I mean, it's good that you know so that you don't start asking everyone what's going on when you already have a video available for, available for you. Of course, I always also write what I say on the video on my update in my profile so that you don't have to watch the whole video. Videos are more about details, I guess. So, yeah. And it's not bad news, you know, it's just some stuff that's going on right now, which is why I haven't had but that much time in my hands lately. <coughs> it's something that's probably going to be happening soon. <coughs> you will also have information about my personal life. And it's not that I have a problem with sharing my personal life with people, it's just that if you really don't have to say it, then you know what's the point but uh, right now if I get something that it's gonna be done soon hopefully uh, that's what I'm working on then I will share it with you guys because uh, 
there might be like a slight chance that if it does get done, I will be unavailable for perhaps a couple of days or maybe like two weeks at best. But it really depends, you know. I don't know what's gonna happen, so I'm just saying that if, uh, right now so that you guys can keep your eyes open for an update video. Of course, I also figured that not everyone uh, watches the the Banjo Run, or you know, it takes time because uh, I guess not everybody is hooked into YouTube, <clears throat> and you can't like expect all of your subscribers to watch everything in one shot. But I guess I will just display it up in the in my channel so that I can be there available all the time and people can see it. Uh, for now you have seen that I have gathered a couple of jigsaws and a couple of notes. This area right here, you can actually come here later on in a different form and it would be a lot easier to pick all this stuff up. But I guess I'm just gonna pick it all up right now as I am, because you can do it like this too, so when we go transform to Mumbo, it's gonna be so that I can hopefully just exit the world, uh, I mean get the last two jigsaws and just uh, exit the world and go in that form so we can pick up something. Of course, I did miss something as I entered this world. I forgot to open a gate that I'm supposed to open as Banjo. But I will. What I'll do is that I'll exit the world in the f in the transformation. Then I'm gonna come back to the monster mansion uh, off screen and then edit it out. And you know it'll feel as if I didn't lose any time so I guess it's no big deal but keep in mind that for those who are playing that if you uh, go outside this world and you will see to the left of the world or to the right of the world's entrance you will see a uh, you're gonna see a gate that you're just supposed to knock down and just go away for for that moment. I will show you that by the end of this walkthrough. Um, when I get out of this world, I will, I will show you. But that'll be on the last part of Mad Monster Mansion. Uh, yeah, but I guess it's normal. I mean, everyone forgets something once in a while, so yeah. <coughs> All right. Um, I guess I have picked up everything from here. I'm like half dead already, so let me pick up some life. These uh, skeletons can be beaten by the golden feathers as uh, the green ghost. I guess they're immortal if you just keep hitting them with the not regular attacks. The golden feathers are just gonna kill them. <coughs> I do leave them around so that when I'm running low on life, I can just break them and recharge a little bit. Yeah. I guess, those, I guess those tentacles also go down with the golden feathers. <clears throat> and if those uh, particular things aren't, so it's in another level. So anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching and take care. Bye-bye.